All right, let's bounce around a little bit. Oh, locals in the back. How y'all doing back there? Back table, you see me? Yeah. Yeah. Y'all back, is that where the rail dropped y'all off at? I have to walk a little bit. We made it, we made it. That is fucked up. From an empty pineapple field to the back of a crack house. We good. It's cool, it's good shit. Uh, Douglas, y'all gotta stop letting the white man trick y'all into shit. Alright, that rail is ridiculous. But then this year they had y'all build a wave pool next to the ocean. We ain't supposed to do there. We ain't supposed to do there. Well, but this wave pool don't got sharks in it. Oh, okay. Okay. That's cool. That's cool. How much it costs to go into the wave pool? $150 a month. Oh, okay. So your wave pool also don't got people in it. All right. I get it. No sharks, no people. We cool. <laughs> Glad we got this multi-million dollar facility <laughs> next to the ocean. Shit is wild. It's good. it's good though. We gotta fix that rail though. You gotta take all these homeless people wandering around and put them up on top of that rail. That's my plan. Put them up there. Set them up top. All right. And then right at the bottom, to build a drug treatment center. And then a couple miles down, you build. A, a school and education center. And uh, another mile from that, you build a, a job treatment center. You just keep repeating those three all the way through the rail, all the way to hold from Pearl City to Why Not. And then anytime a homeless person comes down, you're like, are you ready to get clean? Are you ready to get a job? Are you ready to get an education? No, to get your monkey ass back up on top of the rail. <laughs> Oh, 